from you know yesterday we were carried away talking about davido and whiskey with mom's barrier davido choma twins video with sam clef and everything the beef we were carried away and we forgot something did you know kiss danny kiss danny had a very very serious issue in abijah yesterday he was almost arrested was almost arrested and detained in Ivory Coast for not performing. You know, Chris Daniel already already uh, posted about the whole event. He posted a video, a bragging video that the flight is about to take to Ivory Coast will cost forty million naira. He showed that that he wore one point something million. The OD had the uh, something like two million naira and the cap and everything, just showing of bragging. But uh, not knowing that, he's going to face issues there. You remember now, a few years ago now, uh, last year when he was arrested in that country, I forgot. He was arrested, humiliated, arrested, or, or, and they were even made to perform another, another day, the same event. But this time, okay. According to what he, uh, he wrote, uh, trying to explain what happened, he said, This might definitely get a lot of people in trouble, but damn, enough is enough. CAF didn't deal with us directly. It was through an agent. He was supposed to perform for, uh, for CAF, and uh, he was paid through an agent. They didn't deal with him directly. He also said, The agent signed my contract. Which stated no money, no performance. I agreed to fly in regardless. After so many appeal of an of course excuses on bank transfer delay with promise of receiving the money upon arriving in Abidjan, till now no payment, not even not even the alleged amount mentioned. I still choose to support CAF and went ahead to the venue to perform without payment. But unfortunately, my three minutes performance slot was up. My team were, ass were assorted backstage and I decided to take my leave. The agent signed my contract. We state no money, no payment. I am not arrested by CAF or detained whatsoever. I am fine and headed to London for my show, November 12th, OVO Arena, Wembley. Well, he said he wasn't arrested, but the whole show of that he was going to Africa Coast to perform uh, at an event organized by CAF, well, they didn't pay him. They didn't pay him, and the three minutes he was supposed to perform, he didn't perform again. Because they refused to send the money to him. They refused. This is one thing again. You know, eh? Now, you know, it's based on say, oh, I know this artist, I know this artist. That is why some agent will treat some artist anyhow. Please, artists should have this standard. If you do not pay per payment, I am not going there to perform. I think there should be a general body that will safeguard the artist's interest because they should they shouldn't be held in such embarrassing moment just imagine flying to another country without payment now do me the payment i am here i'm ready to perform if they talk about bank transfer problem you are doing it to somebody like his daniel that's what they do and to they do for dubai that time they will do able to perform regardless if the artist don't perform now you would inquire fans will be blaming the artist oh this and that well, thank God the issue wasn't about getting arrested. It wasn't about that. He wasn't arrested at all, like what he said. He's already, uh, he has already left to London. But there were reports yesterday that he was detained for refusing to perform. Just the same way they would have humiliated him. He is, is in Uganda. Yes, now Uganda, they humiliated him there. They arrested him, make him look like a criminal. Because... Some artists do not want to talk because they want to just keep short and let everything. No, if not me be that, I mean not the talk. I will, I, will, I will bring out my portable mentality out. 
I will bring it out. Scatter grand. How can you invite an artist to perform and you refuse to pay him? I kiss down it and I want for you. How you go leave Nigeria? Go uh, go another country. Go perform without the number pay you dime. But after all, they booked the flight though. Paris with that flight worth 40 million naira. 40 million. Ah. For 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 chartered of jet. 40 million. Then boast around the whole show without performing and also getting humiliated. They say according to him, they beat all his uh oh, they beat up, they assaulted his uh his uh, people backstage. His team, they beat them up backstage. But he wasn't there though. And now he has moved to London for his show. That's crazy, man. You guys should treat all our artists better now. Stop disrespecting our Nigerian artists. Huh? Stop. And like I've said before, they should have a body that will safeguard their interest. It's not just performing for free going to this country because they are paying. No, no, no. They should have a body that will safeguard their interest as well. And uh, listening to this news about uh, an update of Mubad, Naramali, and Sam Larry. Well, they said a court, a court in Lagos just called them. According to the airline, listen, guys, they said. Lagos Kuruna summon Naramali Prime Boy Le Samlari over Mobas dead. When I saw this uh, Corona, I was like, what the hell? What is uh, Lagos Corona? I was like, I had to go through, reread it. I was trying to understand. I'd be the misright. Then uh, I got a little bit of a uh, Clarity on the whole matter. According to a point, they said a Lagos Corona court sitting in Ikurudu has summoned music star uh, Naramali, Samlari, and Prime Boy over the death of uh, Aloba, aka Mubad. In an ongoing request to determine the cause of death of Mubad, the Corona magistrate uh, Adedoye has summoned music star appear before the court on October 24th. The purpose of their appearance is to shed light on the incident and uh, identify any individual responsible for the tragic event. The coroner instructed the State Criminal Investigation and Intelligence Department to ensure the presence of the music star at the next adjourned date of October 25. The coroner court has the duty of investigating the cause and circumstances surrounding certain death that are considered to be unnatural, violent, uh, violent or cases where the court where the cause remain unknown. Well, this whole case, eh, they are making it to tire Nigeria, honestly. The case though they died down and not be the same energy we put for this case as at last month, beginning of last month that we are putting in this case now. Not 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 the same energy. The energy is going down, it's going down, and that's exactly what they want. Let the energy go down so that we can know how to safeguard some people. The only person I'm pitying eh, now the auxiliary nurse, like I've said before, prime boy has no case to answer to. He fought with somebody two days later, the person go take injection, me not supposed to take. So, wait to consign Prime Boy. Now, Prime Boy give an injection. He has no case to answer to me. He has no case to answer. The people who have case to answer, I think, is Naramali and Samlari because of what they did. What they did. Because what they were doing to that guy is not acceptable. Prime Boy and the, and the Mubad, they can fight. Now, friends can fight. Anybody can fight with somebody. Anybody can fight with anybody. It's a, it's a form of self-defense. You cannot slap me. I will not defend myself. So it's a form of self-defense. So, but all I'm saying is that the matter is going down a little bit. Nobody cares now. Now, nobody, they be do, 
and trauma matter we are not talking about about the twins and the videos there we are talking about a whiskey bonds barrier that's what we are discussing now that's what is going to check the internet that is what is like people are getting tired well when you drag you draw you drag matter drag matter drag back matter too much people will eventually say oh what the hell is this self people will eventually just forget the whole matter so they are making it tire us do this thing once and for all you know take this matter to court what again investigation is, is concluded up to see you know you don't know very they just brought out five prime suspects so do this stuff and uh people are saying uh, insisting that the wife has something to do with it you know it's getting crazy but all i'm saying is that the matter is dying down a little bit nobody cares too much about it again unlike before now unlike when the matter was trying to really really trying 